Bao, good day to you. Today we'll be reviewing this multi tool made by Yangdong Usalan Hardware Industries. It's a seven in one tool. But first, I have to tell you this little thing. I am not actually with the company, affiliated with them in any way or sort. I'm just a consumer. I bought this. I never really got to know what it, what it was, but after this deep search online, I got a similar tool. It looks exactly the same, but it's a 10 in 1. Link is in the description. Okay, this is the pouch the tool came with. It's made out of a strong fabric. This opens like this. This is the belt. You can hook it to your belt, have it like a utility belt. Very handy. Now, to the unpacking, you open it like this. You take the plastic wrapper off. And your first impression of it looks like an AK-47, like a nunchuck. Has this futuristic design of some sort. Okay, it's first. This is made out of completely out of steel, so it's actually pretty heavy. It weighs around eight ounces, 240 grams to be specific. This is made of packa wood. The packa wood is this blend between wood and plastic. It's mainly used for wooden knife holds. So this is exactly the use for it. When it's open. You get this pliers. Now it's 17.5 inch uh, centimeters, which is about seven inches. This is the pliers. You see here. This you can use this actually to strip wires. I've actually done this myself. Pretty handy. Now just fold it back. Very easy. Here on the right. This has five tools. This has only one. We're going to review this first. The one online has five here and five here, but this this is different. This has a flashlight. This is not made out of steel. It's made out of hardened plastic. This is the lead, actually, if you can see here. It's kind of strong. It has three batteries inside. I'm going to show you. Three bulky batteries. So the trick is, once you get them inside the shaft like this, just don't over twist this because what will happen is the contact will cause the lead to be ignited. So just you'll have the balance once you get one of these. Now let's go to the right wing. This has five different tools. Each tool now has its use. I'm going to go through them from the top to the bottom. Okay. Go here first. We have knife. This is a small knife, pretty sharp actually. You can use this for all sorts of small things around the house. Slice an apple, pick some chestnuts, you know, in the winter. You can do that. Open an envelope. Of course, you can use it for big things, but you'd rather keep it clean. So, this is the next tool. This is handy actually. This is a can opener, and right here you got a flat head screwdriver. So it's a two in one kind of. This is the small, you put your fingertip like this and pull it out. Now we take the third tool, which is a Phillips head screwdriver. It has no other purpose, it's just a Phillips head screwdriver. See that? It's pretty straightforward. Now we've got the chisel. You can use this to scrape wood. And it also has a different size flat head screwdriver. We have the final tool, which is the fisherman's aid. This is a fish hook disgorger. This is a fish scale remover. And this is a small file. What I like about this tool, it's a four in one actually. You got the fish scale remover, the hook disgorger, and the, the file, and there is a small ruler here, six centimeters, zero to six. Okay, this is this sums the entire thing. Thank you for watching, and uh, please like, comment. Thank you.